Yo, yo, you too. It's boy, I will back here with another review with some some heat I picked up. <clears throat> um, I'm a hype beast. This. Now this is gonna go on my feet. Right here's the seat. So I'll check it out. Legit. So here we go, start of this. Nike SB Dunk Diamond Slash Tiffany Edition. Which some people say this is not the Tiffany. It, in my opinion, it is the Tiffany. This is the Tiffany signature color right here. This is green. Okay. And, um,. You know, they put the diamond on the tongue, so we're going to get up into that. But uh, this shoe right here, retail for $107.95. And last time it made an appearance was 2005, and they when they dropped it, it was a low-top shoe. And nobody knew that it was going to get as rare as it did. But this shoe got rare. And so the low is worth a lot of loot if you got it. Um, I seen this shoe, and I thought, you know... Um, you know, I love Jordan 1s. I rock Jordan 1s. Um, you know, who who wasn't a, a fan of, a, you know, Air Force 1? I think everybody at one point was a fan of Air Force 1, whether it was a high or low. <clears throat> so, bumming in the shoe. Getting into the shoe right here. A little design on the wrapping paper right there. Let's pull them out. Now, the colorway on the shoe is Tiffany Green. Tiffany Green right here. And this right here is Black Crocodile, or some people call it Faux, Faux Croc, or I don't know, whatever that is. You know, with the metallic silver Nike swoosh on it. And then up here on the upper, you got the diamond on there. It says Nike SB. And this is a dunk, Nike Skateboarding. And this, this shoe right here is sick. Dead stock, totally dead stock. The shoe is sweet. So these just came in. I'm definitely gonna rock these. I'm not gonna sit on them. I'm not gonna keep these on ice. I'm gonna rock these. This this shoe right here is sweet. Now my last video, or uh, on the video that I did with the Kobe, where people, some people commented on it and said, "Oh, you're hype beast in the shoe. You're hype beast in the shoe." I had an opportunity to get that shoe, so I did. Now that shoe has got traded for the Jordan Red Infrared 23, which I'm going to wear. So whoever it is that wanted to play basketball in that Kobe, I gave them the opportunity to, to, to give them that shoe. They could do what they want with it. I could do what I want with my shit. I'm going to wear these. This is not a hype piece. This is, this is, a, this is a very, very dope shoe. This shoe's gonna be worth money, you mark my fucking words. There we go. The detail on the front of the shoe is just crazy. Look at that. But, I mean, the detail on the shoe is ridiculous. They did a very, very, very good job. I don't know how these shoes are in terms of whether or not they're gonna crease right here. All the Jordan ones in my size, size 12, they crease. You know, this is um, this is my shoe, which makes it a size 12. You know, but this is a this is a real, real, real. Even though I mean, even the box is dope. Tiffany Tiffany green with the black Nike SB on the front. This is my first SB that I've ever owned. This is the first SB I ever owned. Probably might be the only one I ever owned. Um, the reason why I got it is because I just, you know, I love the diamond on the tongue, the whole Tiffany theme, the colorway was sweet, the black crocodile popping out like, ooh, you know, the tongue, even, even the tongue on these, man, the way, the way that Tiffany green hits that tongue, man, it just pops, almost sparkles, such, you know, 
back on there the way it's sewn the quality it's perfect look at them cuts yeah very nice very very nice um in my opinion in my um fashion opinion i will have to stop the laces right about here probably and pop this tongue out so everybody can see that diamond and other than that, man, this shoe, i seen it, must have, must grab. So, if you got your hands on these, Tiffany Diamond SB Dunks by Nike, big up, because this shoe right here is hard. This shoe is very hard. I don't, this, this, you know, this isn't a, I don't think this will be too much of a, considered a hype hype shoe, you know what I'm saying? I don't think I took no skateboard or shit, you know what I'm saying? Even though I don't skateboard, I probably, probably could skateboard if I wanted. But if I did skateboard, I definitely would rock these shoes right here. These are very, very, very dope. Very dope. So if you got your hands on a pair of these, 2014 Tiffany Dunks. The retro of the 2005, but they came out with the high top. Big ups. Must have, must grab.